Welcome to Dead End Sports, where sports opinions collide. I am one fifth of your host, BZ430. Uh, another quick video. Just want to discuss real quick. You know, first of all, how is everybody Tuesday going? This is recording as this is a Tuesday, um, January, was it January 11th? January 11th, 2022. Hope you guys are having a wonderful, wonderful Tuesday. Um, real quick, I just want to talk because Steph Curry did a uh, interview for uh, GQ Sports, and he said he feel fully healthy. The 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 KD Warriors, the war. So we want to say 2016 through 2018 Golden State Warriors with KD on it when KD was on was on the squad. He says that. So let's say 2017 Golden State Warriors. He said 27 Warriors can beat the 96 Bulls. We know the 96 Bulls went won 72 games. End up uh, winning the championship for Jordan's fifth championship. So was it fifth? No, I'm sorry. Fourth championship. My bad. Jordan's fourth championship. So that squad, the 95, 96 Chicago Bulls against the 2016, 2017 Golden State Warriors. Steph Curry feels that he can beat them. I'm going to have to agree. But someone who, you know, y'all, you know, I'm one of the people that always glute and go crazy about 80s and 90s and basketball about how the era was good or whatever whatever but i will say this and a picture was posted up it was a starting line they just posted the starting lineups right so it was as you know steph clay durant andre Godala, and draymond and then the lineup for the bulls was ron harper jordan pippen ku coach and robin so yeah i'm gonna have to go with warriors on this one i'm gonna have to go with warriors on this one just in the seven games, I say Warriors and Steph Curry said Warriors and six. I kind of agree. I would say Warriors and six, you know, or seven. Warriors and six or seven. But um, yeah, so like Jordan's gonna do Jordan. Jordan's gonna score, you know, he's gonna score his 35, 40, maybe 50 points. You know what I'm saying? Especially if we're if we're going by today's era rules. If we're going by 2022, and I'm gonna say 2022. Damn it, we're not in 1996. So I'm just going to say today. You work that 96 squad in today's NBA, today's NBA against the 20, 20, 2016, 2017 Golden State Warriors. Yes. Because like I said, Jordan's going to score. His, he's he's going to do him. He's going to get buckets over Clay. He's going to get buckets over Clay. But Pippen don't have shit for KD. I'm sorry. We all know Pippen is literally one of the – you know, top, you could probably say top five or easy top 10 best ball on ball defenders in NBA, NBA history. You know, Scottie Pippen was a, a very good defender. Scottie Pippen was what, six, seven, about 215, give or take. Scottie Pippen never had to guard no one like a Kevin Durant. Kevin Durant is going to get buckets on Scottie Pippen. Now, he may make it a little tough for Kevin Durant, but Kevin Durant goes still score. I say Kevin Durant and Steph Curry are going to both score over 30. Ron Harper, we're talking about past prime, bad knees, Ron Harper. He's not going to have nothing for Steph. He's not going to have nothing for Steph. Um, Andre Gudala and Cool Coach, they kind of – Cool Coach and Andre Gudala. Cool Coach is slow as a turtle. I feel like Andre Gudala, they both kind of cancel each other out. Like, I feel like – because if Cool Coach uses size to his advantage, he can he – can, he can, do some things with Andre Godala. But Andre Godala is a great defender. He's a great on-ball defender. Don't, don't, let's not slack that off. But uh, on the defensive end, cool coach, I, I see Andre Godala getting a lot of wide open looks. So, um, and then Draymond and Rodman, you know, I, I can say Rodman getting in Draymond's head and getting him under getting under his skin real good. But I think they both cancel each other out as far as stats and numbers go. But, you know, Rodman's going to get more rebounds. I think j- j- there's only so much scoring Jordan can do. It's only so much turnaround two pointers, and then Kevin Durant, Clay, and Stay Steph is coming back hitting threes. Threes, if you're trading three for two baskets, Golden State is going to win this. Is, is this going to be too much? It's going to be too much. Scottie Pippen in a seven game series is going to be too much for Kevin Durant. I mean, well, Kevin Durant's going to be too much for Scottie Pippen, scoring wise. Scottie Pippen ain't going to. He's going to see what Kevin Durant can do. That's Pippen never guarded up like that during his during his heyday. Even his prime years, Pippen never guarded someone like a Kevin Durant. It's going to be too much. It's going to be too much. I'm sorry. And then let's not forget about the bench. 
Because I'm taking Sean Livingston over Steve Kerr any day. You know what I'm saying? Randy Brown. I'm taking Sean Livingston over Randy Brown. You know what I'm saying? Uh, the bigs don't kind of catch each other out a little bit. McGee, he's a little more athletic than Luke Lonely. But at the end of the day, I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Jordan fanatics, Jordan fans. I've witnessed the Bulls. I witnessed their magical run in the 90s. But no, this, this Golden State squad with Kevin Durant, they, they, will, they will beat the 96 Bulls. Sorry, they will. They will beat them. Five or seven games. I'm sorry. They will take them out. That's my opinion. I just wanted to talk about that because I saw that. And I was like, you know, I'm in agreement. And, you know, as one of the guys as my age or older would probably say the Bulls. They think the Bulls will win. They think the Bulls. They think this Jordan is just untouchable. But, no, not against this squad, man. Not against this team. I think this Golden State squad will beat. They will beat the Bulls. I'm sorry. So let me know what y'all think. Um, what y'all think? Y'all think I'm right? Y'all think I'm wrong? Y'all agree? Disagree? You know, give me a reason why you think the Bulls is still win in the seven game series, or give me a reason why you think go to State win in the seven game series. Let me know. All ages. I, I, I'm literally taking. If I'm going by era, I don't care. I'm not going. Look, I'm sorry, '90s. But go to State got this shit, man. So let me know. Let me know what y'all think in the comment section. I'll holler at y'all. Oh, yeah, don't forget, too, tonight. Um, I probably I won't be on because I'm going to be recording Dead End Gaming. So if you follow Dead End Gaming, make sure you follow Dead End Gaming at uh, twitch.tv forward slash Dead End Gaming ATL. But the rest of the Dead End Sports crew will be back tonight at 930 live. Um, so I'm pretty sure it's going to be Shelton, Ken, FIFO, and maybe Nick, Nicky Duce. So be sure to uh, check it out tonight, y'all. But I just want to drop in my thoughts on this. I know this video is a little longer. I want this to be three or four minutes, but it's definitely longer than that. But um, let me know what y'all think, man, in the comment section. I'll let y'all later. Peace.